ทีมไหนต่อดีเอาตรงนี้แล้วกันครับน่าจะเป็นกดก่อนรอดก่อนใช่แล้ว
See, you don't understand, do you? It doesn't have to make sense. You only need to believe us. About what happens in the future? Correct. I have to know then. Why was mankind destroyed? It's not exactly destroyed. It isn't as if there aren't any survivors left. But a large number are... Yes, the dead number, six billion. It's all because of Radical Six. A horrific virus that affects the human brain. It spread quickly worldwide, and humanity began heading to extinction. The location the virus originated at was the experimental facility, DECOM. That was what we were told, anyway. Some of the information appears to be incorrect, though. How so? This is just a guess, but... I think Radical Six wasn't leaked from DECOM. I've got a feeling it came from this shelter instead. Regardless, back then we believed it all started at DECOM. So we infiltrated the facility as subjects to prevent the release of the virus. With Akane's help. Akane? She's the leader of a secret group called Crash Keys that wants to save the world. Using the organization's assets, we hacked the admin server. And altered the original subject list and data. I... I see. I mean, it all seems so fake. I could hardly keep up with all of it. We're not lying. It's true. All right, then. I'd like to go back for a second. Phi, you said you jumped earlier, right? Yeah. Does that mean... Acid. It's not only acidic enough to melt a body, but it even dissolves glass and iron. Explaining what would happen if you were under it seems unnecessary. That button on the wall is your way to freedom. Using it will kill the other teams, and you will obtain the needed X passes to escape. I have one final thing to tell you. The early bird gets the worm. After the first team pushes it, the button will become inactive for both of the other teams. Your time limit is three minutes. What will you do? Will you press it or refuse? It is ultimately all up to you to decide. Wait, don't! I'm doing it to protect you two! What? It's not to escape! Of course I don't want to kill the other teams. But if we don't act, we're the ones who die. It's not for certain. No one pushes it before three minutes are up. But if we wait, all three teams will be killed. The acid will melt even our bones, and all that's left will wash down the drain. Is that how you want to reunite? To hug and cry together in the drain? 
By then, we wouldn't even be able to see or hold them. Wait, wait, Sigma! Please calm down! How could I possibly do that? Someone on another team could be pushing the button right now as we speak. Just listen, please! Zero did say that we had three minutes. But he never said what would happen once the time limit ended. She's right. Three minutes is just a space of time. There's still a chance nothing will happen after the deadline is over. It must mean that we are being tested to see how much we all trust. Please believe, Sigma. Trust the other teams. Diana, what did you just... Are you kidding me? Wait, Mulan. You just finished begging me to trust the others. Hmm. What the hell was all that for? Answer me, Diana! I, I don't know. I don't know why I pushed the button. Not again. What do you mean? Our vote back at 1330? Diana chose C-Team instead of going along with what was on the note. I asked her why, and she said the same thing as now. I don't know. That's ridiculous. I don't know about that. I know. What? I'm saying, I know what you don't know. My thought earlier, that we probably... You made a wise decision. You sacrificed the lives of others in order to continue your own survival. It truly is a natural human reaction. You simply made an emergency evacuation. The action is legally justifiable. There is no blame to be placed on you for your decision. Now, I'm sure you would like to get out of here immediately. But before that, I apologize. But you must all sleep again. 1929. Our time is up. You have done exactly as I commanded. The memory loss drug will not be ejected into the three of you. It would be inconvenient if you forgot you caused the deaths of others. No! How did this happen? Pleasant dreams. <laughs> โอ้โหทําไมไม่มีฉากอื่นตายล่ะเอ็นเรคคอร์ดตรงไหนเนี่ยอืมน่ามันงงๆไปดูตรงคือเล่นไม่จบเหรอเอ่อเอ่อ I think it's the decontamination room. Decontamination? Huh. This is weird. Weird? I feel like I've been trapped in this room before. You must be imagining things. I guess. Wait, this button. It's the same for you, Carlos? You feel it as well? Yeah, not just her. I sense it too. Somehow, this button is very important. Maybe we've forgotten about this place. 
the drugs in the bracelets? What? Look what time it is. It's after midnight. So it's the next day? Not just day, but year. It's 2029 now. What a horrible start to the year. Now announcing the current casualties. C team, Carlos, Akane, Junpei. Q team, Q, Mira, Eric. These six are now deceased. As a result, six X-Passes will be revealed. Shift, six, ring, age, heart, love. That is all. Damn you, Zero! I will never forgive him! Diana, tell me one more time. You didn't choose to push it, did you? The button in the decontamination room. No. For a split second, it was as if... It was as if someone had taken control of my body. <laughs> Has this ever happened to you before? Then maybe you hit your head somewhere. I don't think so. That I can remember, anyway. What are you trying to say, Fi? Well, I thought it might be possible it was... Alien Hand Syndrome. <laughs> what? Alien Hand? It happens very rarely when the corpus callosum, where the right and left hemispheres connect, is abnormal. Remember, the right brain controls the left side, and the left controls the right. So if the communication paths that connect them are damaged, the left and right sides of your body may fall out of sync. Like trying to put a shirt on with your right hand, but taking it off with your left. Grabbing onto a scalding pan with your right hand while your left tries to make it let go. Or something even stranger, when your right hand attempts to suffocate you, so you use your left to restrain it. I've heard of cases where it's happened. An interesting development arises with that story. Where does a human's consciousness exist? Is it in the left brain or the right? When your right hand's choking you and your left's trying to stop it, that would imply that the part of you that doesn't want to die is in the right brain. But what if in the left brain, there's another part of you, buried inside, that does want to die. So, if you ever ask that person, do you want to live or die? If the center for speech is located in the right brain, he'd clearly say, of course, I want to live. But what if it's the reverse? If the center for speech is in the left brain, then I'm sure he'd say, Hurry up and kill me. There's no way to know which one is the true self. Or, perhaps, it's more like they both are. It's just simply that the one who has the power of speech is more dominant. Have you ever considered, what if your body was split into left and right? 
In that moment, where would your consciousness go? Left or right? Hey, Phi. What are you getting at with this? The alien mouth syndrome. My mouth speaks for itself, regardless of what I want it to do. Hmm. How... how can you be joking around at a time like this? No, it's because we're in the situation that I brought it up. Well, like you said, it doesn't feel real. Hearing the announcement, or reading on the board... You think those six might still be alive? Let's keep believing. There's no point. The six of them are, are definitely dead. How do you know? Well... I don't know. You all right, Gab? This guy doesn't know anything, does he? He's lucky. Well, we may as well get going. Like Sigma said earlier, we shouldn't lose hope. Let's have faith that they're still alive. Besides, that is even more of a reason that we must keep going. So we can go and bring back a rescue team? Exactly. Ship sick ring is hot love. Let's go. Gab lift the wing. Don't make fun. Oh. I'm not going. Huh? Hey, Diana. Judge and Jerry. 
So you thought, how could I make this not as bad for me? What you came up with was oh so simple. You simply needed multiple personalities. No! Not to casually bring up the topic of multiple personalities, no one would believe you. The only way to make it believable was to do something unbeneficial to you. And that is why you refused to leave. We both know that Vi will bring the rescue team back to the shelter. You saw all of that in advance. No, 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 no! Let us meet again somewhere. Stop at Mata Dolorosa. I will be awaiting that moment. Game over. You need to die. They pulled on my neck from size of no. I'm sorry. I need to go. Club. Pay. Look. Not. 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 แปดเจ็ดหกห้าสี่สามสองหนึ่งหมดเวลาไม่ผมนับผิดสิจริงๆสองวิกกว่าก็ต้องเป็นสามมันใกล้เคียงกับสามเนาะ Nothing's happening. Yeah. See, I told you, didn't I? None of the others push the button. So that's proof that the other teams can be trusted to cooperate. It seems there may be a misunderstanding, so I shall clear it up for you. I never said the showers would activate as soon as the button was pressed, which means. You've yet to learn whether the button has been activated by someone or not. What? And when? Then the anesthetic will... <clears throat> I get it now. Don't tell me we'll be asleep when... Now, it is time for you to sleep. When next you wake, know that you will have no memory of these past nine minutes. Pleasant dreams. หลับอีกแล้วโอเครอดหมดเล่นทีมไหนต่อดีแล้วกันมีทั้งสามทางเลือกจบอันบิดเด็กส์โอ้ the reactor this nuclear reactor automatically supplies electricity for years without any extra input how do you know all that I read it in the manual that's right over there What? You, you don't think Zero plans to lock us in this shelter for years and years, do you? That's not funny. It's pointless. I checked it already. <laughs> Damn. That means we're trapped. <sighs> It's the new year. 22 years since Maria was born. Never thought there'd be a time... I couldn't wish her Happy New Year. This is the worst year ever. Is she your girlfriend? No. She's my little sister. Shh. 
she uh, fell ill 10 years ago and was admitted to the hospital. I figured she'd be lonely in there, so I always stopped by after work. Oh, um, that's... Every good morning and good night was so important to us. And now... Oh, that's right. Lights on. <laughs> Happy New Year, Junpei. What? What's with you all of a sudden? I've wanted to say that to you for ten years, but I couldn't. You, you say it now, but I, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to say. At least give her a proper response. You're her boyfriend, right? No, I am not. She's... she's just a childhood friend. Really? And here I thought you were dating. Uh, hmm. Carlos? Whoops. Uh, I'm sorry if I made things awkward. I just wanted to learn how you guys were connected. That, you know, the best way to build teamwork is to know who your partners are. How like a firefighter. Yeah. <sighs> well, we'll leave it at that for now. Okay, we can't hang around here like this forever. Let's find a way out. Thử thay là sắp son nè. Fire and throw up.
ผมนี่ใส่เสียอยู่อย่างคือตอนแรกเราต้องดูต้องกด R2 ก่อนเนาะดูคำอธิบายว่าไม่ให้ทำอะไรมาลุยต้องเอาตัวตรงกลางเนี่ยตัวเนี่ยเนี่ยที่เคอร์เซอร์ชี้เนี่ยเป็นตัวเชื่อมนี่ไงมันจะได้ง่ายอะ่ะดูนี้ดูมันติดกับอะไรอ๋อนี่ไงเป็นนี่เออนั่นแหละคืออันนี้คือสองอันนี้ถูกแน่นอนอันนี้ถูกแน่นอนสองนี้ถูกแน่นอนแล้วต้องไปปรับนี้นี่ไงสี่เหลี่ยมเซอร์ถูกไหมเนี่ยนี่ไงเซอร์เองก็งงเอมกันนะเนี่ยอ
ส่งไว้ปั๊มกุญแจต้องหาอะไรมาใส่อะสิซิงเหรต่อดีอะเราจะไม่คิดไฟแล้วให้ทางขวาเนี่ยหรอเ
เส้นกันเนาะมันเส้นหน่อยเนี่ยสั่นตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ๊ดตุ
Repeat law. Mong lấy làm lại tòa nè. ต่อล่ะไหลไปเนี่ยนี่ต่อดีเอ่ยเ
จะเป็นต้องเต็มเนาะเพราะมันที่วันนี้ใช่แน่แน่แล้วไปตรงกลางอะ่ะ
ดีๆต้องใช้นี่นะเพราะมันเหลือนี่อย่างเดียวในที่สุด She's okay. She's just unconscious. Her breathing and pulse are normal. I see. Now announcing the current casualties. Q T. Q. Mira. Eric. These three are now deceased. As a result, three X passes will be revealed. I. Q team, they. It, it had to have been the vote. No, we can't be sure all of Q team was really killed. Oh, yeah, yeah, y you're right. We need to focus on getting out of here somehow. Um, you seem to be forgetting that the exit's still locked. Well then, all we can do is go into that room. What the hell is this thing? Maybe game. Akane, she's laying down outside. The 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 hell is this? No clue. Something's up on the monitor though. ถ้าไม่โหวตทุกคนจะถูกกำจัดก็ไม่เหมือนกับภาคสองทีเดียวเพราะว่าภาคสองถ้าเลือกอาลายทั้งคู่นะจะได้แค่สองแต้มอันนี้ก็คือว่าถ้าคาร์ลอสเลือกอาลัยจุนเพเลือกอาลัยจะได้คนละสามแต้มแต่ถ้าคาร์ลอสเลือกอาลัยจุนเพเลือกบีเทรคาร์ลอสจะเสียสามแต้มถ้าคาร์ลอสเลือกบีเทรจุนเพเลือกอาลัยคาร์ลอสจะได้6ถ้าเลือกบีเทรทั้งคู่จะได้จะไม่มีใครได้สักแต้มต้องต้องผมพูดผิดต้องบอกว่าทางคู่อ่ะจะไม่ได้สักแต้มเออถ้าทางคู่เลือกโอเคนั่นแหละเคบวกหกลบสามถ้าใครก็ตามได้ถึง9แต้มประตูจะเปิดประตูทางออกจะเปิดถ้า BP เหลือศูนย์จะถูกกำจัดหืมเล่นนี้เล่นนี้เลยเหรอเนี่ยมันบอกว่าคนอื่นเนี่ยแชร์โชคมีโชคชะตาเดียวกับคูณก็คือว่าถ้าคาร์ลอสตายดิอานากับซิกมาก็จะตายถ้าจุนเปตายอากาเนะแอนฟายจะตาย Share the same fate If I die Akane and Fai die too And Diana and Sigma are killed if I die Hot damn How far is Zero going to go with his toying with us Ally or betray Well, what'll it be, Carlos? What are you saying? 
Isn't it obvious? We choose ally twice. We'll add six additional points to our initial three, and we'll both end up with nine BP. No one dies, no one gets hurt. The exit door will open, and C Team will be able to get out. Oh, yeah, I get it. There's nothing gained by choosing Betray, right? Zero's aiming for us to kill ourselves off here. All right. Hey, um, before we do this, do you mind if we check on Akane? <sighs> this girl here, she's always been really smart. If she thinks the tiniest thing is off, she'll start debating with buts and ifs, like, like someone at least twice her age. But to all of us, back in grade school, she was pretty strange. Well, I, I guess she came across as scary. Did she get bullied a lot? No. It was just, well, not many people wanted to be friends. I always saw her sitting in a corner, curled up, hugging her knees, and all alone. I decided that I'd stay by her side to watch over and protect her, if I could. Then one day, her beloved rabbits were killed by some stupid middle schoolers having fun. She didn't take it well. So, without telling me or the teachers, she went to their hutch, crying and, and apologizing over and over to them. That was over 10 years ago. Uh, a memory that's been tucked away in my brain, covered in dust. <laughs> when I saw her again last year, I was, I was reminded of that time. I just can't not keep an eye on her. I, I know, she always goes and <laughs> just quietly shoulders everything herself. That's why I want to protect her. I wanted to help her bear whatever weight she's taken up. I truly felt that. But, well, I don't know. It was like, it was like I didn't know her as well as I thought I did. Hell, I couldn't, I couldn't understand why I even cared. I wanted to find out more about who she really was. To go and, and see her. Come on, you, you have someone you really care about, don't you? Yeah, no, you mean my sister? Yeah. My parents died in a fire. And then Maria fell ill to an incurable disease. Above anything else, I want to save her. I want to see her smile like before. That's what I decided. That's why. Ah, now I get it. That's why you need the $500,000. Uh, mm. It's clear we both have someone we want to protect. And neither of us can afford to die now. Right. So let's get out of this room by both picking ally. We'll work on getting out of this shelter after that. Okay. Let's get this over with. Yeah. Back to the room for us. Don't get the timing wrong, okay? We have to enter them at the same time to... I know. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. ผมขอเลือกจบแบบแย่ก่อนแล้วกันนะ
Oh. What? No way. <laughs> Sorry, Junpei. Wh why? It's because you would have picked Betray to protect Akane. That's what I figured anyway. Don't lie. The three on Q team are dead now. If three more die, the X store. That's why you. No! I wanted to protect Diana and Sigma. Hmm. But the shield that protects became a spear in the end. That'll come back to bite you in the ass. Carlos, I swear, I'll get you for this. Forgive me, Junpei. Oi. None. <laughs> How dare you! How dare you kill Junpei! Akane! Oh. 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 Akane Sai Hot. Akane, you. Junpei. ไปโผล่ตรงทีมอะไรเนี่ยทีมคิวตายเนาะอันนี้คือเลือกยาแก้ผิดถูกแล้วก็อันนี้คืออะไรเลือกยิงปืนหรือแดนน่าจะยิง
I swear, I'll get you for this. None. This is... This is... Like when I'm in a fire. Up until now, I've... Uh, I've avoided the paths leading to death. So then maybe I can... Please, don't think badly of me for this. Later. Ma... Game over. ไปต่อตรงนี้เนาะเพื่อจุนเพมจะเลือกอะไรดิดชีเกิดบูลลี่ด้วยไหม No it was just well not many people wanted to be friends นั่น Where? You okay? Is is this before the A B game? What? Okay. Uh, should I keep going? Y yeah. I always saw her uh, sitting in a corner, curled up, hugging her knees, and all alone. I I decided I'd stay by her side. To watch over and protect her if I could. Huh? Then one day, her beloved rabbits were killed by some stupid middle schoolers having fun. She went to their hutch, crying, and apologizing over and over to them. How? How, how do you know that? Did Akane tell you? No. Then why? Uh, so, gonna stay silent, huh? Uh, fine. I uh, guess there's no point talking about this. Let's just get these votes. No, wait. Something's weird. Hello, pot calling kettle. Whatever I chose in the A B game, it was always the worst outcome. What are you talking about? Um, uh, Junpei, Carlos. Ah, oh, I think I understand. I believe that what you just did was shift, Carlos. Shift. Space-time human internal fluctuating transfer. A phenomenon where one's mind crosses space and time. Akane, is... is that...? The power we used a year ago? The ability to send and receive information through the morphogenetic field. It's a simpler version of this. You're saying the me here right now came from a different history? Well, your consciousness, at least. Say you go back in time to when your parents met, using a car as a time machine. Know what movie I'm talking about? Uh, yeah, of course I do. The high school protagonist almost gets it on with his own mother and tries to get his awkward dad to marry her. That's the basic plot, right? Yes, the story revolves around a boy. We'll call him M. Now, according to the plot, he's successful at getting his parents to marry. But history ends up changing slightly. Upon returning to his own time, his father's a famous science fiction writer, and he's rich. Huh, I guess the hierarchy was switched when his dad punched the neighborhood bully. But 
Did you notice something odd about the movie? Just what happened to the M who lived in that fancy house? Huh. Well, now that you mention it. Oh, I, I, I don't think the M from that history appears in the movie at all. There are two overarching types of stories about time travel. The first type states that there is always only one history. Meaning, if someone changes the past, that previous past is subsequently erased. The other type is where multiple histories exist. This is the many worlds interpretation. One of the more widely believed hypotheses on multiverse theory. The world and universe split into branches as a result of one's decisions. It's a setup where each branch is able to exist in some form. Okay, so back to the movie. First, let's consider what happens with a single path history. In this case, do you know what M is doing back in his own time? What he's doing? Committing a form of murder. Murder? Well, think about it. Uh, the M who grew up in that fancy house, let's call him M2. M2 should have had a variety of amazing memories from his life. Maybe he met a really cute girl he liked, or was a winner of a contest. The possibilities are endless. All of those memories, every single one was overwritten when M came from another history. Huh? But the history that disappeared was poor M's. You're right, that's true. What was erased from existing in time was M's history. But the only memories that M retained Ah, uh, are those of when he was poor. So, in effect, the life that M2 lived through was overwritten, all because of the actions that the protagonist M took to save his own. I'd say that's the same as killing someone, don't you think? Next is the multiverse hypothesis. In this situation, M2's life is never erased. Instead, a mystery remains. So, where did M2, the version who remembers being well off, up and disappear to? Where he went? This is what I think. On the same day that protagonist M used the time machine, M2, for some reason, did the same as M and went back to the past. But then he did the exact opposite of M. The opposite? Mm-hmm. He stopped his dad from punching the bully. So, when he returned to his own time, it was the world poor M had lived in. Are you saying that they pretty much switched places? It would keep everything consistent. That's depressing. What is? Uh, M2's situation. Well, he ends up getting the bum end of the deal regardless of which scenario happens. Damn, that's pretty unfair. Yes, that's true. But, uh, this is rather difficult to say, Carlos. Your case may be exactly the same. What? Your consciousness could have come from another history and taken over this body. In exchange, the Carlos who was here originally... No. Another me is in the other history? Uh, there's no use in getting upset. You simply need to accept that that's what shifting is. Yeah. But wait, Akane, how did you know that Carlos is able to shift? He mentioned before that he knows which path has death at the end and which is safe. I just sort of knew too. 
An arsonist set fire to our house when I was 18. My parents didn't make it, though I was able to get my sister Maria out. But we didn't make a clean escape. Maria fell into some sort of coma. They first thought that she had carbon monoxide poisoning, but that wasn't what it was. Reverie Syndrome. A variety of moments flicker in and out of the mind, as if one was constantly dreaming. We believe this is what your sister has. Maria is either receiving large amounts of information from the morphogenetic field, or her consciousness cannot stop its jumping between multiple histories. Huh. Then she's like us. Yes. Uh though it's slightly different. In Maria's case, that power is running rampant within her. That is what the Reverie Syndrome really is. What? If a way can be found to control the ability, then she could recover from it. Is that true? I see. That's good. So there's some hope for her. Hey, Carlos. When you dove into the fire to save your sister, you were able to hear her voice, right? Yeah, I was. Carlos, I'm here! I'm over here! Maria! Maria, is that you? Just stay there! I'm coming to get you! No matter how you look at it, there was no way her voice could reach me. But I realized exactly where she was, and I found her quickly. That was the first time. After that, I could hear victims crying out in the fires, and which way would lead to my death. Oh, this, this ability we have is triggered by intense danger. When we are threatened by a crisis, it's easier for us to access the field. I get it. So that's what it was. So... Carlos, Junpei, shall we shift? Huh? What? There's really no reason to play the A-B game. Well, as it stands right now, it's incredibly likely the both of you will decide to pick ally. But instead of going through that, it'd be better to shift to another history. It'll work! The three of us will definitely be able to do it! But... Only if we find our lives in danger. Wait, what do you mean by danger? The control panel has detected an error in the program. Main cord required to supply additional deuterium. Please quarantine or disconnect the control panel. Hey, uh, 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 Kane? Hmm? You're really turning the reactor into a bomb? I told you earlier, didn't I? Our lives have to be in danger for our shift ability to manifest. But this, this is absolutely nuts! Even if we do manage to do this, the us who are from whatever history we switch with will end up... Do you plan on dying here then? Oh, right. I forgot you were like that. The main cord is preventing the shield from deploying. Please evacuate now. Please evacuate now. So, where do we need to jump to? Um... Well... You... you didn't consider that part? Well, hmm. if we knew in advance, the effect of the threat would be lessened. You're not affected by any of this at all, are you? That's not true. Here, look. My heart's pounding so fast. Do you want to check it? Uh, Two minutes until detonation. Uh, hey, it's kind of getting down to the wire here. Ah, uh, shit! Okay, uh, we're just gonna have to go for it. Jump to the same history I am! The same history? Which one? 
Think! There's a history when we didn't get all ones on the dice rolls. The moment right after that. Are you insane? We're just gonna get ourselves killed! It's okay. I have a plan. 30 seconds until detonation. All right. I trust you, Junpei. Ah, damn it! Junpei, if we die, oh, I'm gonna kill you. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one. ตรงที่เอ๊ออยิงยิงแล้วซิกมาตายแล้วไปไหนเนี่ยอ๋อแล้วก็ไปที่พอยลูกเต่าสามลูกแล้วถ้าไม่ได้หนึ่งเหมือนกันก็ตายใช่ไหมเนี่ยแปลงล่างหรือเปล่าดิดิวอร์กบัดดิสอิสฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮึฮอะไรอ่ะ What the hell? Carlos, put Akane in the fireplace. Huh? Just do it. j u n p e i what are you? Akane, listen to me. Carlos and I are going to be your shield wall. What? What are you talking about? The bullets shouldn't hit you if there are two bodies in front of you. But, but if you do that, then you'll. It's okay. Listen, Carlos and I will protect you and die. The fuck? Don't worry, it'll be fine. Before we die, we just need to shift to another history. Once you hear all of the X passes, Akane, you should follow right away. The, the X passes? In this history, five are already dead. Five's the only other one alive. That means five X passes will be revealed. If Carlos's and mine are added to that, then there'll be seven. No! Damn it, Junpei! What the hell is this plan? You're going to help, right? God damn it! Please, don't do this. We, we can't go back now. This is the only way. Where are we jumping? To the history when we rolled the dice and they were all ones. Okay. okay. Let's do this then. Let's protect Akane, no matter what. I'm counting on you, Carlos. No! 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 Oh. ว่าไปตรงทอยลูกเต่าได้หนึ่งทุกคน
Diana, Sigma. C Team, Carlos, Junpei. These seven are now deceased. As a result, seven X passes will be revealed. I kill fool moon fate save doll. That is all. แล้วก็วาร์ปไปที่ตอนหลังจากโยนเหรียญได้หนึ่งทั้งหมดอ
Akane, do you remember the X passes for Junpei and me? Yes. Normally, when someone shifts, they forget the memories from the last timeline. But I'm used to it. It's all there. But wait, hold on. Carlos and I remember what happened before, too. Huh. I think the memories were strengthened due to the resonance effect. Those with the ability to shift... Oh, there are three of us here, so... But I wonder why. Why have three shifters gathered in a place like this? Doesn't really seem like a coincidence. Huh. True. Even if we really are seeing more shifters in the world, the probability... Wait. The numbers are increasing? Mankind is about to face an unprecedented crisis. As it stands now, we'll lose six billion lives. I assume mankind has sensed that and is adapting. Even though it's in reality only a small portion, there's no way there are tens of thousands of shifters. Then it's definitely on purpose. But we signed up for DCOM of our own free will. Wait a minute. But maybe we just think that. And in actuality, we did exactly what Zero wanted? It's highly possible. Ah, damn! What is that bastard thinking? Wasn't it because he needed us to shift? Why would that be important? It'll all be over once we get out of here, anyway. You're right. We couldn't care less what Zero has planned at this point. We need six X-Passes. We know five of them already, so... One more. Akane, tell us one of the other X-Passes. It's save. Hey! What the hell? Wait, wait. Is the X-Pass wrong somehow? Th that can't be! Let's try the other one, too! Akane! Uh, it's doll. Doll. What was doll name? Never know. Say doll. Say I'm not going to die. You're going to have to be a person. None. What the? No way. But why? X passes are sent to their respective histories. X passes from alternate timelines are not applicable. None. Wh what? No. <laughs> Password not a random. <laughs> now this is hilarious. How perfect. Why? Why did we even struggle through all of that just now? Those guns turned my body into Swiss cheese. And you're telling me that it was all for nothing? All we did was die in vain? So, just one person needs to die. What? Just, just one more person and Akane and Carlos can... Junpei, you. Wait, Junpei. Hey. Oh. Oh, I don't know. Oh. Junpei. Uh, you're. Penalty, penalty. You are charged with a rule violation. That means you must be punished. B punished? Time to exterminate. 
Exterminate. Uh. Oh. Tẹt không chứ Khổ Mày làng mình dỡ chẳng Damn it, he's so strong Any more of those punches and This is That, that was cutie I gotta do something. If I die now, Junpei and Akane, think. I gotta think. Ah, there must be a way, some way, to survive this situation. Ah, there has to be. I believe that what you just did was shift, Carlos. That's it. Shift. I could shift! There's no way I'm leaving Junpei and Akane behind. I'll come up with a plan in another history and jump right back. Ah, uh, but where do I go? Which history should I jump to? Damn it! I don't have time to think! Then... Oh! Ah! <laughs> Oh. Mm -hmm.